Hey world. Be able to come back to another video. Guys, today is uh, Memorial Day. And it just blows me away all these frivolous holidays and recognitions when you don't put anything behind the words. See, it's like a narcissist that, you know, make all these promises and tell you how great you are and how much they love you and how you the greatest thing ever happened to them and they can't be without you and without you guys, you know, the American people, our military, nothing would work. But where's the action behind your words? You know, my sister, my grandfather, my dad, you know, we had a lot of family members, cousins, all joined the military. You dig? And right now, all, you know, getting that military wake-up call. Because remember, there is no actions with those words. Be all you can be, you know what I'm saying, Air Force One, all of that crap. I mean, there's no actions with the words because how is it that, you know, the politicians that the military protect, they are vested in five years and they get their pension and they make $178,000 a year and they good. The greatest health care, you know, great investments, you know, the best food, the best water, they live good. But those that protect them, the military, and remember, Secret Service and the police and those guys are all really ex-military. They don't get the same, you know, incentives. They don't, And I don't understand it, but I do understand it because not only do I understand it, I understand and understand that this country is not a country. Okay, this country is not a country. It's a mass of land divided by those in power that takes 99% of the wealth and the land and assets and, of course, make us pay for the lands and assets that we acquire that they have taken, i.e., the home you live in. You don't own the land, right? The car you drive, you really don't own it because you still got to pay taxes and get insurance and do all that kind of stuff. Your own children, you don't own because you have to put them in public schools or have a reason or have the financial means to put them in private schools. But you see the circle? The circle of disaster is to make sure they keep most people financially ignorant. Family, save your money. Pay yourself first. I mean, if you don't recognize the, the, the deception, I mean, just think about today. It's Memorial Day and... I don't see any, you know, news coverage of them, you know, saying, you know what, we're going to celebrate our veterans by, you know, making sure that they don't have to pay rent or mortgage or property taxes to the next year. You dig? Or those who are, you know, family members of, of, of veterans who have transitioned, they don't have to pay property taxes or pay their mortgage for a whole year. Or the whole, I mean, give them something or a month. Give them something. But this whole notion, I mean, did you guys even know that it was Asia Pacific Islander Heritage Month? That mean, that mean Asians and those from the Pacific Islands, you know, Hawaii, Tahiti, you know, all it's they have a whole month. I didn't even know we had a huge population of Hawaiians in America. But I digress. Pay yourself first, family. Enjoy the day. And uh, like I said, if you can do anything for a veteran, please make sure you can look out for them. And in the meantime, between time, may the most high inside of you bring you joy. And be what is out of